We're not looking at doing a bunch of things that only work in training sessions. We have to look at this as an extension of the body and it's screwing as it comes in. So as it comes in, coming towards me, as it comes in, I'm going to take it. We're going to use this theory today to turn our body and to turn the machines when we're in interaction with our training partner into a rotating wedge. And we're moving around that point of rotation. You can also see that in the helix, when we talk about this movement right here, we're simply turning it and we're doing it out here. Okay? So, that's the first thing that we're gonna work on with our training partner is using these movements to begin to cut into the training partner. Then we're going to go with much larger movements like this, very wide rivets. Now I want you to look at something when I'm moving. Remember, the inclined plane like I talked about, we're simply moving around the inclined plane. I'm making them up, I'm using a theory. I can pull it back, but you can see that I'm always coming back to that screwing movement. Now I've got mechanical advantage. I can direct, I want you to start rotating around this point. Work on the screwing motion, come in, there, come in. As it misses me, as a means of turning it, 